Hello everyone, uh, my name is Chan So Kim with the lab chief of Organic Optoelectric Material Lab in Department of Chemical and Biomolecular Engineering of KAIST. This is our OEM lab members. Uh, our prof professor is Hee Tae Chang and there are 24 students in our lab. Uh, there are two postdoc students and 10 PhD students and 8 master students. Also, there are, uh, there are three part-time students who work outside KAIST and one staff member. And all the students of our lab have a chance to go visiting scholar for six months abroad, so there is one member who is in the U.S. This is all in lab members in each research area. Uh, there are main six teams in our lab. This includes bottom lithography, top-down lithography for fabrication, and catalyst, optoelectronic sensor, water purification membrane, and energy storage application. Each student has their own research topics, and it, we conduct the research by discussing with each team members. So our research area can be exhibited like this. We fabricate various nanomaterials with nanostructure control. This fabrication and synthesis method includes top-down approaches and bottom-up approaches. Soft, soft lithography, 2D material exfoliation, and secondary spot lithography are the example for our for top-down approaches. And we use supramolecular self-assembly, as defect, and wrinkle structure in case of bottom-up approach. From these techniques, uh, we apply various nanomaterials to various applications like gas sensor, battery, optoelectronic, and CO2 reduction catalyst. This is the main technique of OEM that is called secondary spotter lithography, that is SSL. By using secondary spotter phenomenon, we can make very high resolution and aspect ratio of nano pattern. It is basically derived by attaching metal nano cluster on the wall of pre pattern by R1 plasma. So after removing the pre pattern, we can make this like very thin wall like nano pattern. The component and thickness also can be controlled easily in SSL. Therefore, it has various advantages as shown in this slide. Uh, firstly, it shows high, a super high resolution and aspect ratio by using diverse material, materials, and shape and size also can be controlled from a linear pattern to circular pattern. And large area of fabrication and mass production are possible. So this technique could be applied to various applications, including gas sensor, catalyst, energy storage, and, and bio-applications. So our lab showed distinguished research performance in the last decade like this. Uh, there are over 157 papers in SCI journal, and 56 of domestic and international patents. The publication include these like high-impact journals, like Sister Journal of Nature Science, Advanced materials and HS Nano. Not only all our OEM do the research, but also we enjoy many events like attending to conference together or workshop to resort and periodic membership training in every summer and winter. Also, to refresh our daily graduate school life, uh, we open various events with all the lab members like Manito, PC game and sport event. Uh, soccer and birthday party. So we always maintain very close relationship among us by this like event. Thank you for listening to the introduction of our lab and contact us if you have any questions.